Passenger trains to and from Russia, which start and terminate in Ukraine, may soon be stopped. Ukraine's infrastructure minister, Volodymyr Omilan, says the proposal to cut all eight scheduled services would not affect any transit services between neighboring countries and Russia. Transit train routes that run from Moldova to Russia through the territory of Ukraine will not change. If the circumstances require, we may implement restrictions and the trains will pass through Ukraine's territory without any stops. All these trains that are now running from Ukraine to Russia can potentially be used for internal transportation of Ukrainian citizens to resorts or any other places that are in demand. In 2015, Ukraine halted air transport with Russia. However, the functioning capacity of trains and buses has not grown as a result, the minister says. During the day of the 17th of August, two transit trains departed from Kiev Central Railway Station to Russia, and one is a transit train. Here is what the passengers, who are mostly from Russia, had to say. What choice do we have? Of course we'll keep traveling. We'll travel by buses to Kharkiv and from Kharkiv. And from there there are buses to Belgorod. Of course I'll keep traveling. I think that everyone will. I travel twice a year. I live in Russia. I'm a citizen of the Russian Federation. I came here for the first time. I was visiting my grandma for the first time in six years. We're from the far north of Russia. Well, we definitely won't run across the border. Road connection will be the only thing left. Now the measures have to be approved by Ukraine's National Security and Defense Council. These were the remaining public transport links with Russia. Kiev stopped all airline traffic with Moscow more than three years ago. Some officials say the sanctions was prompted by a decrease in the number of passengers between Ukraine and Russia. Railway statistics show a nearly five-fold drop over the past few years. The move comes in the face of mounting Russian military aggression in the Azov Sea.